In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to download Apex Legends for free on Windows. So the first thing that you want to do is open up your web browser and then you want to click on the first link in the description. Now when you're on here, you're going to see a download for free button on the right. You want to left click on it. And over here, you're going to see three different platforms. You're going to see PC, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Now I'm doing this tutorial for PC, so I'm just going to select Origin on PC. As you can see, the installer for Apex Legends should now begin downloading on your computer. So you just want to give it a couple of seconds to finish downloading. And once it's finished, you want to left click on the installer. Now the Origin client should pop up and they're going to tell you to install Origin to play Apex Legends. So what you want to do is select install Origin. Over here you want to keep everything at the default and then you want to select that I have read and accept the terms of the end user license agreement and then click on continue. As you can see, Origin should now begin installing on your computer, so you just want to give it a couple of minutes and then you want to come back. Once Origin has finished installing on your computer, they're going to ask you to sign in with your EA account. Now, if you already have an EA account, then you can just put in your login details here and you can select sign in. I haven't created an account yet, so I'm just going to click on create an account. Over here, they're going to tell you to select your country or region. I'm just going to choose United States. They're going to ask you for your date of birth, so you just want to put in your date of birth. And then you want to check the box, I have read and accept the user agreement and EA's privacy and cookie policy and then click on next. Now they're going to ask you to create your EA account, so you want to put in your email address and you want to select a password. Next, they're going to ask you to put in your public ID. What this is, is basically your username. So I'm just going to put in Volks here. Now, if the username which you've selected is taken, then you can just change it. And then you want to click on next. They're going to ask you to choose a security question and they're going to ask you for some of your privacy permission. So I'm just going to leave this at friends. And here I'm going to opt out of receiving emails from EA and then you want to select create account. After you've selected create an account, they're going to ask you to verify your identity. So what they're going to do is send a verification code to your email. So what you want to do is open up your email address. I just have it on my Gmail. And over here, they're going to tell you your EA security code. So that's four eights and then one one. And once you've put your code in, you just want to select continue. They're going to give you a success message and over here, you just want to click on get started. Over here, they're going to ask for your language. I'm just going to keep this at English and then click on accept. Next, they're going to ask you to install Apex. So what you want to do over here is keep this at the default location and then you want to click on next. Over here, you want to accept their terms and then click on next again. Now, as you can see, Apex Legends should begin downloading and installing on your computer. Now, the game is around 13 gigabytes, as you can see over here. So it is going to take quite some time before the download is finished. So what you want to do is just give it a couple of hours and then you can come back when your download is finished. Once Apex Legends has finished installing, what you want to do is click on the orange view and library button. 
and over here you just want to go ahead and click on play and as you can see apex legends should now launch